the so this one we're gonna do it by tables so uh, and that's only part b because i already did part a before so the initial xt was equal to e to the negative 3t cosine 2t plus 30 ut which it's equal to e to the negative 3t x eight of t all right this is just a simple now if we already said that x a of t is equal to cosine 2t plus 3 so and that's ut so what's uh what's its laplace transform my laplace transform would be cosine according to the table then we're dealing with we're dealing with this one right here so according to the table we're gonna do we're gonna do is <coughs> cosine of theta which is 30 degree minus sine theta which is 30 degrees over the square of the root over the, the square sum of squares the square the sum of squares sum of squares right and then uh, this follows that this is gonna give you a number it's gonna give you another number and it's gonna be something like this s this is 0.866 minus 1 and square plus omega naught square omega that's actually 2 so it's going to be 4 this is omega it's omega and this is theta and you get a number there and then um, after that all we're left with is the uh, so, uh, to do the, the time shift or the is it time shift property or the shift property I think this is a shift property well, uh, but it should go in this way x2 of s would be equal and that's what we were trying to find here x2 of s but we first needed to find uh, this is x2 of t and so x2 of s would have been e to negative 3t uh, oh Never mind. Let's, let's continue here. This would have been. This would have been. X a plus three because of this. <coughs> so I guess what I, this is what I wanted to write up there, but it makes more sense to write it down here. So following this into this one, it would be x two is equal to s would be a plus 3 point a six six is plus 3 minus 1 over s plus 3 squared plus 4 which is equal to <coughs> Point six point eight six six is plus one point six over this plus three over x squared sorry x squared six s plus thirteen. That's it. Thanks.